written down so you know what to do for the remaining. Uh, Davin and we're not doing any homework quizzes. We're just doing our homework. So on this problem, what they ask us to do is they want us to find um, the length of LM. They're asking us to find this length. <clears throat> Guys, I'm going to have to either move any rows or just be, pay attention because I'm going over the homework that's now. Um, so to go ahead and find this, um, what we simply need to do is be able to find the length. Now there's a formula that I provided to you guys. Yes? It's 125. Okay, this is off of the last homework that I went over, page 125, question 1 through 20. Okay? So to find the formula for this, I'm just going to simply do length equals x degrees over 360 degrees times radius times pi, or pi times radius, doesn't really matter. All right? So to find the length of my arc, I need to go ahead and use that formula. So if you weren't here last class period, that is the formula that you need to have. All right? Now, what we need to do is when we're talking about the angle, what does x angle rip represent? That represents the central angle, which I'll talk a little bit more about. So to find the central angle, we need to look at our arc LM, which is a minor arc. And the angle for LM is 100 degrees. So therefore, the length is equal to 100 degrees over 306 degrees. They tell us the radius is 5 inches, so it's pi times 5. Now, I simply just now need to go ahead and plug this into my calculator. So I have 100 divided by 360, which is going to be 5 over 18, times pi times 5. And when I round to the hundredth, I believe they're asking us to do, is going to be length equals 4.36. And since we're talking about inches, it's going to be in inches. Now remember, this is a length. So this is going to be in our first dimension. It's not going to be like area, which was unit squared, or volume, which was unit cubed. This is length, so it's just going to be inches as we were previously taught. All right. So for problems 15 through 20, on your homework, I would probably write down that general formula so you guys can do the rest.